Hey everybody, we're in handicapping thoroughbred racing from Parks Racing, Ben Salem, Pennsylvania on Tuesday, March the 27th. This is my dayofthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 9 this afternoon, folks. 3.50 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Langhorn Stakes. Six and a half for a long sprint on dirt track. Phillies and mares, four years old and up racing four. A stakes prize is some $75,000. Contenders, number three, winning image. Number five, pilot point lady. Number four, island bound. And number seven, high quality. Number three, winning image, the overall speed leader in the stakes field, sprinting at or about today's distance of six and a half furlongs on the dirt, takes a class drop of seven track master units, excellent early speed abilities to complement for this sprint. She has turned in a quartet of power runs in her last five starts, hitting the board in three, including a power run win in her third race back. Number five, Pilot Point Lady, a four to one shot, has hit the board in four straight, winning twice, including a power run win in her second race back. Race nine summary, number three, winning image tops my contenders list, which also includes today number five, Pilot Point Lady, number four, Island Bound, and number seven, high quality. That's a three five four seven in the ninth from Parks, the seventy-five thousand dollar Langhorn Stakes. Bonus long shots, Charlestown, race six, number four, real quiet time, a nine to two shot. Speed ability racing at or about eight and a half furlongs on the dirt, which are equivalent to the favorite, number five, General Rutledge. And in Mountaineer Park, Chester, West Virginia, tonight, race four, the five to one shot, number four, Vintage Dave, the overall speed leader in this climbing field, sprinting at tonight's distance of six furlongs on the dirt. So from Parks Racing, I still call it Philly Park. On a Tuesday, Ricky DeFord, dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.